minutes. Nothing too crazy. Okay, so this is my Conway's Game of Life project where I have a grid of N by M cells, each of which is uh, has a value of a Boolean 0 or 1, which indicates whether it's alive or not. What I do is I update the cell for, I update the graph for each cell. I check the, I count the number of neighbors it has, all eight neighbors, not all four, but all eight. And I check if it is two or three and it's alive, then I keep it as alive. If not, I kill it. If there's exactly three and it's dead, I resurrect it back, back to life. Yeah. Then I got this with frame rate 10. It looks nice and all, but if, eventually after some time, it will settle down and go to an equilibrium where everything's just boring, right? So to spice things up, I decided to add color, right? No one, no one hates color. Everyone likes color. So first I had the, I had the I and N. Yeah. So what I did to make color, it was to linearly interpolate every, uh, to linearly interpolate the ratio of the x index to the width and interpolate it to the hsb scale yeah and i got the petri dish i haven't i have to put it here yeah yeah so then it looks like this oh did i oh Oops. All right. Yeah. No. Ah. Oh, we're just exploring the options. Nothing. Oh, there we go. Yeah. You know, it's like this. This is this was the original. This was our original idea. Right. Then uh we just experimented with more. And eventually we got to something very shocking. Where instead of uh have interpolating it based on the exit x index we interpolated it based on the number of neighbors it had and we didn't replace it with black if it was dead and we got a, something that looked like a petri dish Ooh, which looked nice. yeah <laughs> Good, nice it looks it's nice in a scary kind of way yeah mm. and speaking of scary to add more of the scare we translated <laughs> it to rgb to rgb and basically focused on red, where it basically looks like it came straight out of a horror movie. Like red. Yeah, that's the doom. <laughs> Creep, creeping doom. Yeah. Mm. yeah. <laughs> and then, uh, as, but then all this time, we've only been interpolating on one of the scales, right? In RGB, we've only been interpolating on R. So we decided to go, we decided to shift it around to red, green, and blue. And personally, I, I think I like the blue one because I like blue in general. So it's, it's all personal. Mm. There's no hot things. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, that's more of a yellowy one. Wasn't oh, it? oh yeah. It's 255. Well, we did have the bluey one going on quite nice. Yeah, bluey one, it's 100. Man. Yeah. Ah, very cool. This is okay. Yeah. Thank you. Let me stop the recording. That was awesome, Zuz. And a very nice showcase of what.